What is up ladies and gentlemen, CJ the Cheese DJ here and we are back with another episode of Story Arc for you guys today and as you can see, our big boy Reaper is all raised up. Look at this sucker. Now, we haven't put any extra levels into it, we got the full imprint off on it, we've got 22 levels available, we took it out for a bit of a run to get some meat and to level it up obviously. It came out with 25k base HP, 400 melee damage. I am... So stoked that we found this 150. So I'm honestly going to give it some health. I reckon is 30k enough? Do we go 30k? Let's go 35k and then just literally dump the rest into melee damage to be honest. It's hidden for about 400. Uh, well, it was hidden for about I think 403 with its melee damage at the moment. It's extremely weak at the moment though because it, it has just finished raising up and obviously it's got no um, no health or anything like that. We've got our rock drakes all raised up. Uh, they were raised up last episode anyway, I think. Um, but what we're going to need to do, we're going to need to move these guys away, but I'm just going to put a ton of food in here for these guys. For anyone who's hungry. Dig in, fellas. And I'm going to put some more meat over onto this trough inside the base. But uh, today, guys, the plan is we're going to be hatching a bunch of megalos. So we need to bring up our Megalo army again. So I'm going to just get a ton of those guys hatched up. We've got heaps of eggs over here in our uh, mutated one. You can see here we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight of them. Uh, she's still breeding. I should probably turn you on to breeding as well, actually, now that I think about it. Enable mating. There we go. Otherwise, it's going to take forever. But uh, I need to move the rock drakes out of the way first because... It's going to be very hard to, to do anything with them in the way. So we need to get them out of the way. So you guys come with me, please. I don't know where I'm going to take them, but we're going to take them somewhere. At least seriously, that's stuck. Move you over here. And get through. All right, here we go. They're unstuck. Sweet. Let's go then. You guys are coming with me this way. We're going to park these guys over here, I think. Just sort of outside of the bases area so that they're not in the way of anything. Don't fall off the edges. Yeah, I think I'll just park them over here. There we go. Alright, you guys chill here for a sec. Well, I'm kind of, I'm really stoked about that, uh, that white and yellow one and black. They can sit there though. They're out of the way, which is good. Uh, you're our weight one, so you can get some weight. Cool. Alrighty, so they can just sit there for now while we go about hatching all these megalos because... We have a lot to do. Now, I'm not sure whether or not to do them all at once or just gradually. But I'm thinking probably just do them all at once. We're going to have eight megalo babies running around. It's going to be probably a little bit annoying and hard to deal with, but it should be fine. Let's chuck all these down. Have a look at everything's incubating. All right, that should be fine. We'll, I mean, we'll see what happens when we come back. But what we're going to do in the meantime is we are going to come in here. We're going to come across to our smithy, where we've been very busy making a bunch of shotgun ammo. We are going to come back into here, and we are going to go like that, like that, like that. That's another 100 shotgun bullets. I'm going to take these bad boys. We're going to take these. We're going to take our bow and arrow. And we're going to go make our way into the cave, into the, the artifact cave. We're going to grab that as well, because that's got another fertilized egg. We're going to go into that artifact cave where the glow tails are because we need to get the artifacts. So I'm going to try and do breeding and artifacts today. And then maybe, possibly, we'll take on Rockwell next episode. I don't want to promise anything because I don't want to get you guys' hopes up. But it's a possibility. Let's grab you. We're going to take uh, this Megalo just for backup purposes. Thank you. I also want to grab a pair of our climbing picks. Uh, climbing... Grab a set of those, and we should be good to go. Alright, cool. Let's jump on you. You don't have a saddle. Never mind. We're going to jump on weight. We'll take weight out, just because it can get some levels while we're out. And let's head back over to that cave. Now, uh, we've still got to go get that other one, which... The one that's all the way in the rat zone. Good news is we sort of know how to do it better this time around, so we shouldn't die and lose any rock drakes, I'm hoping. As long as our rock drakes have enough stamina and whatnot. The only cave I see us having an issue with is the freaking underwater one. Because 
It's underwater and there's no dairies, so I don't know what we should do for that. I don't know if I want to tame up like a baryonyx. Oh, the frames. There we go. I don't know if I want to bother trying to tame up another baryonyx or like a sarco or anything, or if we just do what we did last time and take one of those other rock drakes that we had. Because, I mean, it did okay. We just, we really got screwed over by the Nidarius. That's what really screwed us in the gooch. So, let's get back over here. Let's get into this cave. We've got this guy. I haven't actually been out here in ages. And we will come down here. And uh, get this cave done. Now, I'm pretty sure we can't take cryopods into Rockwell either. Because last time we... So when we did it, we, we had the drakes, right? But we had them sitting out. So they weren't really doing anything. They were just copping a bunch of attacks from his tentacles. And then obviously when we got to that second phase, the nameless. So I was just thinking we could keep them in cryos until we actually need them. But I don't think that'll work. I don't know. Let's come down here. Alright. Here we go. We're probably not going to need him. We're going to reload. We've got our bow. We've got our shotgun. I think we'll be okay. But it's... Oh, let's just let the game render in for a second. Unless, of course, we're crashing. We're good? You good? Alright, cool. Oh. I think this might have been the glow tail in here. Let's find out. Let's get in here. We're going to go out killing a bunch of stuff. And hopefully we can get the artifact. We do know the shortcut. Now, I couldn't remember where the shortcut was. But now we do know where it is. So we can probably just do the shortcut. And it'll save us a heap of time. But I don't know if I want to try and get any uh, drops or anything like that. Don't know if we want to try and get some drops. I should have brought some flak armor because our hazmat suit is pretty banged up. It's pretty banged up. But we should be okay. Hello, Kano. I'm going to use this on him. Oof, look at that damage. Easy. Got a seeker. That's dead. Alright, we're just going to take our time with this cave. We've got about five minutes till those eggs hatch back at base, so... Should honestly be able to slam the, the, the cave out in that time. There's a freaking jellyfish there. In fact, I can probably just climb back up there with the climbing pits. You die. There's a glow tail over here. That was a 145 bloody Nidaria. What level are you, little dude? Level 100. Not bad. Alright, uh, so we've got to come down here. This is where the little entrance was. Okay, we're getting attacked by a damn raptor. And I think there was something else that just fell down with it. I'm going to, as soon as I can get up, shotgun this sucker. Where the hell did he go? Oh, he just fell down, I guess. So the shortcut we need to take is in through here somewhere. Ooh, that's a sucker. I love this shotgun already. So much better than that last one we had. I'm going to kill these piranhas. If I can. I don't really want to go for a swim. I'm pretty sure this entrance is around here somewhere. Pretty sure there's a little entrance we can go in. That'll take us straight to the artifact. Whoa, Jesus. Can you stop jumping at me, mate? It's making me nervous. Die. Die. Okay. That's taken care of. I'm pretty sure this entrance is around here somewhere. I shouldn't swim in the water because of the piranhas. Honestly, we're not too fussed about the ammo situation. We got heaps of ammo back home. Pretty sure it's around here somewhere. Oh, it looks like we might have to go through the whole cave. Maybe we can't get back up to the little entrance. I swear you could have, though. Because I swear it takes you out, like, right around here somewhere. Through here, maybe? Yeah, I don't know, actually, because it should have been here. We've checked the whole sort of bottom ex section here, so it's got to... I don't know. I mean, I guess we'll find out when we uh, get to the end of the cave. Let's just keep going. I could have sworn it was over here. I could have sworn. Can I climb up there? Huh. Good thing we bought the Ascendant ones, that's for sure. Keep climbing up, mate. Had a boy. It's not up there. Well, that was a whole heap of pointless. Let's get over here. There we go. Cool. Alright, if we need to, we can pull out our Megalo, but I kind of want to do it with just our shotgun. Is that bad of me? I don't know. Oh, that's a big boy. You're dead. Pretty sure we have to go down here anyway. Oh, there's a Karkonos. Maybe I should get the Megalo out. Okay, 
man. There was a lot of dangerous stuff. I got a little bit scared. I, I panicked. Woo! He's still alive. Seriously? All right, you know what? We're bringing out uh, the Megalo. I'm not risking it. I'm a bit scared, to be honest. We ain't risking it. We're just going to bring the big boy out. We're going to just munch on everything. Teach these guys a lesson for trying to bloody kill us. I'm sorry, little glow towel dude. You're going to have to die, mate. Kill the raptors. Oh, man. Damn bastard. Holy shit. Looks like we're going to die here anyway. Arthropleurus. Arthro damn pleurus. I don't think I can get back up there either. Uh, hold on. Fertile lake. Upper mushroom. Upper mushroom. All right, let's try and get back there. That really annoys me. The stupid raptors. Because our Megalo literally should have one-shotted that. I should go back to base, claim the babies. Otherwise, we're going to have trouble when we get back there. Where did I end up? That's a nice equus. Oh, we're over here. Um, I think I might go back to the base and kill... Not kill. Get the babies, because... Otherwise, it'll be too late to claim them by the time... Well, it won't be too late, but they'll be, like, grown up. And we don't really want that. So let's go find something to fight, like this roll rat over here. Get that to kill us. And then... We'll go back to base and we'll bring something else back over here to deal with those stupid bloody Arthropleurus. Hey mate, come kill me. Eat me. Eat me. Come on, do it. You yeah, chicken. Hit me. There we go. Alright, cool. Now we can get back to base. We can claim these babies up. We can get that done. That's not our bed. That's our bed. I was going to say we're about to spawn at the wrong bloody place. All right, cool. So the babies are going to be hatched. We'll get them. Uh, we'll take something else, maybe like a Ravager or something to the cave. Because we can't, I don't think we can get back up to that point. Reaper King butt in the house. All right, here we go. Look at all these babies. And they all got the blue mama. Or oh, most of them. Oh, we got it. Is that a mutation up there? I see. I'm thinking that's a mutation. That orange body. Is that a mutation? Four out of 20. Yeah, that's a mutation. Cool. Alrighty, so we got another color mutation. Awesome. Uh, I should probably try and figure out what stats. 7, 8, 3, 19. I'm pretty sure that's on par with everything else. That's what we really just care about, to be honest. The health and melee damage. Yeah, so nothing amazing. But we got another baby over here that we haven't claimed. Oh, is it you? Alright, cool. So that's all the babies claimed up. Let's leave them there. They should be fine for food. Is there still food in here? Yeah, they got all that food in there, so they'll be fine. Let's jump on one of our Ravagers. And we'll just take that guy over to the cave. I'm not worried about our uh, Megalodyne. He'll be fine, honestly. Like, he should be fine. I don't think anything bad is going to happen to him. Um... Let's come through here. We've got a bunch of eggs. These are going to be so good for when we need to get levels. Because we're just going to sacrifice them all to them. And they can all just get eaten by the Megalos. And that's how we're going to build our army back up. Through the murder of babies. Yeah, I'm a little bit... It's a little bit sadistic, I know. Alright, let's grab... You'll do. And let's get out of here. I knew I kept you guys around for a reason. Alrighty, guys. Here we go. Back at the cave. Let's get in here. I hope we can get back up to where we were. Because I know there's that section in the cave where it's like a big... Do you fit? Oh, you bastard. You don't fit through. Well, turns out I'm not taking the Ravager in there. So hopefully I can get back up to where it was. Hopefully. I don't have any more cryos. I didn't think I'd need more cryos. It's coming up to night time or something? No, it's the middle of the day. Was it this dark the first time around we came through here? Alright, let's come down here. At least we got all the baby Megalos claimed up. They should hit Juvenile and they'll just feed off the trough, which is fine. we got plenty of time till the next imprint, so that should be all good. Ah, oh, shit. Um, uh, what? what did, oh, well, we're dead. God damn it. Why does everything have to respawn? We were literally just here. Alrighty, guys. Well, after that shit fight, we're back here. We've come slightly more prepared. We've got a full set of flak armor. We've also got a cryoed up megalo uh, with us as well that we've brought in. Uh, we left the Ravager at the door because, well, the megalo is better and we had to go back to... We were at base anyway. So we've got a full set of flak on. It's only primitive, but... 
It'll keep us alive against the stupid Ravages and the Kano. So let's come in here. We also brought another set of climbing picks because I wasn't sure whether or not we would, uh... We would need them. And of course, there's a freaking Raptor. I'm just going to whistle for it to go kill him. Because I know the moment I get in there, it's going to just... They're all going to rip me off. Kill it. Kill him. Kill the Raptors first. All right, we're fine. Now we can deal with all the rest of this shit. Why are they pushing us so much? Stop pushing me. Oh, man. You bastards. Was that worth it? Are you happy now? Like, I thought this cave was the freaking easiest cave. I've died more times than we did on the other one. Oh, that's annoying. All right, let's come over here. At least we made that jump. Hopefully there's no more raptors in here. There's some ravages. Ravages I can deal with. Ravages are fine. Ravages are not a problem. That was a 135. Uh, yeah, this is one of our boss ones as well. This was, I think, one of the ones that survived. That didn't come with us, actually. So, yeah, we're going to run through here. Can you fit? Yes, you can. We're going to come back this way. I don't think we had anything on us, so we don't need to worry. Maybe let's double check. Nah, nothing on us. Cool. Let's keep going then. Can I make that jump? I'm pretty sure we made it last time, but not this time. That's fine. You sit down there, mate. We're going to climb up because we can cryo him up on the way out. Just in case. Anything wants to go in? Alright, let's get this freaking artifact and get the hell out of this damn cave. Hey! Now, where's our damn Megalo? Don't tell me he's fallen down. Where's our body? Yo, actually, where's our body bag? And our Megalo? Hello? Like, what the actual heck? Don't tell me our body's gone, because I'm seriously going to be so pissed off. That had our shotgun on it, that had our whip on it. Okay, we got our body back, but where the hell's our Megalo? Like, you don't... He doesn't just disappear. Like, where's our Megalo gone? Like, it's not in one of these caves. What the hell? Where'd it go? Uh, whatever. At least I was just... I'm glad we got our body back. That's what I really cared about more. Megalo is replaceable. Our uh, shotgun and whip, not so much. I should probably go back and get the other Megalo that we brought with us. There's a big boy Karkonos down there. We're going to ignore that guy and just keep running. I'm just going to keep running through here. All right, the artifact's over there. I know there was a bunch of dangerous stuff up over here last time we came here, I'm pretty sure. Because we used the Megalo to clear it all out, but it looks like that's not the case this time. So you... Hiding up there, you bastard. Still managed to gnash us as he died. God dang. All right, that's fine. Is there, did he have friends? I don't think he had friends. Alright, hallelujah. We got the artifact. Now we can get out of here. I still don't know where that freaking... Other... Thingy went. Where our Megalo went. Like, where'd he actually go? It scared the shit out of me. I thought it was going to pounce on us. It's like, where's that raptor coming from? Let's try and get this seeker. Can't see anything. Whatever. Alright, I think that's it. I think we can get out of here now. I don't think there's anything else. No, we should be good. Alright, cool. Well, I mean, we finally got the damn artifact. It took us much longer than it should have. Now I just have to remember the way to get out of here. Pretty sure it's this way. Maybe it's this way. I don't remember. Let's go this way first. We'll find out. Doesn't look like there's anything too bad over here. Oh yeah, this is the little cliff bit. Just go down here. There's nothing bad. We're fine. Keep running, keep running, keep running. There was that seeker up here, but I think we'll be okay. Bastards, stop jumping. Like, honestly. It's not going to prolong your survival. You'll die anyway. Alright, I'm pretty sure this is the way out. 
Yeah, it is. Here we go. Yeah, so there's the exit. So where the hell was that when we came in? Because I could have sworn we were in the right area. Is it like halfway up? Oh, it's just... Wait, what? It's behind the waterfall on this back bit. We were looking along this edge. I freaking wonder we couldn't find it. All right, so let's grab our Megalo. We'll get out of here. I don't know where that other one went. It's just vanished to the cave depths. But we'll just grab you and get out because you're one of the boss ones with the saddle and everything. The other one was just a primitive one. But uh, yeah, this one's ready to go. All right, cool. So we've got the artifact. Let's get back to base. Let's imprint on these bloody Megalos. Um, and now we know for next time in case Rockwell fails again that uh, we can just do it from there. So hopefully we remember that this time. Because I didn't exactly remember it last time. All right, hopefully there's nothing new that's spawned in here. No, we're good. All right, cool. Let's get out of here. Get back to base. Alrighty, guys. We're back at base. And they won't care in about 30 seconds, which is awesome for us. Once we get the first imprint off, we're actually going to go do the other artifact, the one down in uh, the rad zone. I just have to remember where the hell it is. I think I remember. Uh, so we're going to take the HP Rock Drake, and we're going to take him down. And we're just going to skip through everything. We're not going to bother fighting and stuff. We're just going to try and skip through it all as fast as possible. I just need to make sure we got enough hazmat stuff. Let's just put all this broken shit away. Um, that artifact going in the vault. And put these extra ones in here. You can go in there. You can go in there. Ah, you can go in there too. Don't need this poo. Don't need that. Don't need that. That. All right, cool. So we still need to get hazmat, so we got one set, so hazard, I mean, hazard, that's what I'm supposed to type. So we got boots, we can repair those, I need legs, another set, and we need two chests, and two gloves. Alright, that's everything, let's whack all this back in here and we can repair it all up, hopefully. What are we missing? Congealed gas balls, we have tons of those, wait are they, they're not in there, we've got heaps of them out here. Let's grab some more congealed gas balls. She's laid another two eggs. Two eggs? One egg? One egg. Let's put that in there. So I don't think we're going to get the whole army back up and running today. Probably going to do it off camera next episode as well. Uh, but I don't think we'll be able to take work well next episode. Sorry, guys. I apologize. I apologize. So let's... What are, we, what are we doing? I just lost my train of thought. Gas balls. We need these boys. Give me those. Thank you very much. All right, cool. So that's the hazard suit. We've got... One of the three artifacts that we need. I'm not looking forward to doing the water one. Uh, might be able to get it out today. Let's see how we go. Uh, what am I doing? Repairing. Repair. 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 Just looks like we're looking good. What am I missing? Crystal. Need me some crystal, which is fine. We can grab you. Come with me, mate. We're just going to grab some crystal. I don't think any of our other teams have crystal. I'm just going to come over to these blue gems. Oh, of course you can't fit. Fire. Give it a couple of swings. Get some free crystal. Awesome. Give me all the crystal. All the crystal. Give it to me all. Alright, that should honestly be enough to repair all of it. Let's take that. Melee damage for you. Let's go. I oh, know i got to eat. I apologize, guys. i just got to go to the fridge. And get it first. Um, come through here. In between the Reaper's legs. I do like the Reaper being there. It's kind of funny. It's like a little entryway for us to go into. Alright, where do we get up to? Here. Repair. I feel like I'm going to need more crystal. And hide, apparently. You got plenty on you, mate. Give me all that. Awesome. There we go. Um, repair it all. What are you missing? Oh, more fiber. There we go, cool. Alright, so that's our two sets of hazmat. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. 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 Dunskies. Alright, cool. They can go in there. They can go in there. I'll eat that for food. And I should have more meat. No, nope, not in there. What am I doing here? Uh, we'll take a stack of the fish meat. Awesome. Alright, they're going good. Let's go imprint on as many of these megalos as we can. Hopefully most of them want cuddles. Comfort food, walk. I really can't even be bothered imprinting on them, to be honest. I know I should be. Okay, we've got two out of eight, I think. 
Some of them want to go on a walk, most of them on kibble. That's fine, whatever. We'll leave them there. Wait, did our imprint timer change? What was the imprint? Mm -hmm. Oh, very 14 minutes. No, that's fine. All right, cool. Uh, let's take our HP rock, Drake. Let's go down and grab this next artifact. Who needs a saddle, which we can grab off weight. Do we take weight, actually? No, we should be fine. We'll take HP because you can get some levels, and I think HP has the better melee damage anyway. Cool. Let's go. All right, so we're going to go... all the way down this way. Let's get over there. I should probably... Do I take a light pet? Do I bother? I don't think we need to bother, to be honest. We won't take a light pet. You, 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 and you. Alright, cool. Let's go. We'll bring you guys back when we're uh, at the artifact cave. Alrighty, guys. And we just made a quick pit stop past our uh, Reaper trap to see if the Reaper Queen would still be stuck there. Turns out she's not, which is really disheartening. So, I'm glad we managed to get at least one Reaper off of her. Uh, like one Reaper King, which is really good. Like, we can't complain. Um, I just wish it was kind of like the Thanksgiving colors. Because, wait, no, that's finished. What am I talking about? I have no idea what I'm talking about. Just ignore me. So, we're almost at the Artifact Cave, I believe. I'm pretty sure it's like just down this way. Pretty much this over here, I think. Can't remember off the top of my head. Uh, yeah, this is it here. So, that's in through there. So, we're just going to cloak up. We're going to walk along the walls. We're not going to fight anything. We're just going to ignore as much of it as we can. And then we should be able to get to the artifact, hopefully with minimal problems. We do have our shotgun with a couple of rounds in it anyway, so worst case scenario, you can pull that bad boy out and just start shooting stuff off the uh, the cliffs and stuff like that. But this cave was a annoying because we got stuck in all the mobs. So let's just wait here for a sec, get some stamina back, and we should be able to just glide our way through, to be honest, right up until the end. All right, here we go. Of course, unless we decide to do that and head straight into the pool of element, which is wonderful. That, that'll that definitely work and not trigger me for the rest of the uh, cave run. Yep, totally not triggered right now. So we should be fine. We're dodging all of that. Let's come up through here. We've got some nameless spawning, which is expected because we don't have a light pet, but at the same time, we don't have seekers on us. I believe I'm heading the right way. I'm not going to jump or do, do the dive just because it'll piss everything off. And we don't really want to deal with pissed off stuff. Oh, never mind. Seekers are angry. All right, so we want to head left from the waterfall, I believe. Through here. And I'm pretty sure it's up through here. If I remember correctly. Uh, let's just stop here for a sec. We'll get some stamina back. And then we can keep going. But so far, this game's gone pretty good. Um, I don't know if we'll do the aquatic one today. Probably if we got time, because I think we have time. But, uh... Just don't know who to take. Don't know who to take. Leave me alone, Seekers. I'm cloaked. You can't see me. I'm invisible. Go away. Okay. Let's come up here. I'm pretty sure the artifact should be just here. Pretty sure it should be just here. That's the one we used for a thumb jam. I'm pretty sure this is where the artifact was, right? Wait, what was that under there? Did you guys see that? Oh, it's just a crystal butt. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure the artifact's supposed to be there. Maybe I put the structure there and it's ruined it. So, I've, I don't know if you guys know, but, like, when we do our thumbnails, I obviously have to set the scene and stuff like that. So, I'm just going to take a quick gander around. Make sure that... Fly, dude, fly. I'm pretty sure that's where the artifact's supposed to be. Where, uh... Where we've put that pedestal. I'll check over here just to make sure. I'm pretty sure that's where it was there. Let's we'll do a little quick scan around here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was up there because I remember going across here and it was up there. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure. I'm honestly just gonna take this one. We're just gonna take it. I'm just gonna kill and get these guys off the edge. How do you guys not walk off the edge of that? Like seriously, look at this dude. This dude's just straight up walking on thin air. 
Oh, man. I'm going to go some stamina here as well because we need a bit of stamina on this guy. Oh, now you fall down, but you fall down with us. That's fine. Whatever, dude. He's running off. All right, let's come back up. Come on. Up you go, up you go, up you go. All right, let's kill all this stuff. Kind of want that feather light in the corner there. And I'll kill this Kano as well, just to be on the safe side of things. Oh, look, there it is. The artifact just spawned in anyway. All right, cool. Now I feel like less of a... Uh, of uh, cheat, less of a cheater. All right, cool. Let's do that. Um, yeah, because when we when we take our screenshots, like our thumbnails, we have to obviously sometimes use admins and stuff like that to get the scene and stuff like that. So we had to spawn in one of these pedestals and grab the art uh, and grab the artifact and put it on the pedestal. But we'll do that to get rid of it, and we'll drop that. All right, cool. So we got two out of three artifacts done. Now the fun part is getting out of this cave. I absolutely hate getting out of this cave. We're gonna give it our best. Let's go. I should have just gone that other way. The way that we came. Dude, do your gliding thing. Why do you just decide to freaking free fall? Like seriously. Alright, let's get out of this cave. Um, and we'll bring you guys back when we're back at base. Hopefully we can probably go for the water one, I would say. And I'm pretty sure i got to go through here. And we go through here. And it's through there. Leave me alone, Seekers. I wonder why they don't attack the feather lights. Why don't the Seekers attack the Feather Lights? Because they're literally like the Shine Creatures. So like, yeah, that's weird. Oh well, doesn't matter. We're out of this damn cave. I hate this cave. That's cool. All right, we'll bring you guys back when we get back to base. And uh, probably go for that water one, I reckon. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. We're actually heading back to base. And I saw like the dust on the floor and look what we've just found. I'm going to get pregnant again. I'm going to kite this thing into the trap. We're going to get pregnant again this episode because you, you can't. There's no way we pass up a 145 Reaper Queen. Like no way. So we're going to get her back to the trap. Where we're going to have to come back because I don't have a light pet. And I'm going to need one of the Megalos I think. Um, and then I'm going to work on getting this lady tamed up because there's no way you pass that up. No one it's literally staring you in the face. So let's get her over here into the trap. I could probably try and tame up one of those feather lights, I guess. And we could use the rock drag. I don't know. That would take us a long time, though. Let's get her into the trap here. Beautiful. I, there is yes, no way we can pass this up. Whatsoever. So let's get back to base. We'll grab um, a Megalo and a light pet. And we'll come back down here. And we're going we're gonna to get pregnant again, guys. Because... It's just too good to pass up. Too good. Alrighty, guys. We got back to base. We have our feather light. We've got everything we need. We're going to get down there. We're going to get pregnant again. 145 Reaper. Just, nah. Too good to pass up. So, going to go travel all the way back down into the rad zone. But it'll hopefully be worth it when we get this. Uh, hopefully, it's still there when we get this Reaper. I'm hoping it doesn't despawn. That's my, that's my biggest fear at the moment. But we've just got to get back to that point where we're at. Luckily enough, we built the trap in a semi-decent area so that we can kind of tell where we are and stuff like that. Because it's kind of like in that southern quadrant sort of area of the map. So let's get back down there. Let's try and get impregnated again and uh, get a new Reaper baby. I know I said we were going to get the artifacts, but I mean, like, come on. If you guys were in my shoes, I'm pretty sure you'd be doing the same. Especially when it was so easy to get pregnant. Um, you'd definitely be getting left, right and center. You'd just be taking it all over the place. So I'm pretty sure we're going to go up here. Pretty sure it's up here. Is that trap here? A little bit further. Let's go this way then. I think we have to bank around actually. Find out what's in here. Some gems and a silencer. Oh, laser attachment. My apologies. Let's go down through here. I think I've gone the wrong way. Yep, we've gone the wrong way. We're on the wrong side. There's that little tiny gap in between. So we need to... I don't know which way I'm going now. We need to go that way. Turn around, Rock Drake. We need to go that way and we need to go around. We went too far. Alright, we'll bring you guys back when we're at the Reaper. Alrighty, guys. We're coming back up on the trap. That's all 45 Reaper. I'm hoping that she's still in the trap over here. 
Yeah, she is. Let's go. We're gonna get pregnant again. I hope that Reaper doesn't catch us while we're out of stamina. Oh yeah, it's coming. Oh god, it's coming. I need to lose this Reaper. I don't want to have to deal with two of the suckers again. Only reason it caught up to us is because we had no damn stamina. Let's come over here. There's a yellow drop, actually. We're going to go check this yellow drop. And we're also going to wait for some stamina because I've got none. Oh, actually, we can do it over here. There's another Reaper over there. Oh, it's a Rock Drake. It's fine. What do you got for me? Oh, an Apprentice Compound Bow and 27 Red Gems. I'll take the bow. All right, cool. So it looks like we may have lost that Reaper Queen, which is perfect. Let's head back over here and we're going to get pregnant. We're gonna get pregnant. Oh yeah. I've never been so excited to get pregnant before. Can we make it? Make the dive, make the dive, make the dive. Let's go. Alright, cool. We're fine. Uh we'll grab you. Throw you out. We're gonna bring you over here, mate. You just chill there for a sec. Let's jump on you. Awesome. Alrighty, let's go do some munching time. So this is one of our super like our boss ones, so like this shouldn't take as long. 145, yeah? Yeah, beautiful. All right, let's get to munching, and we'll bring you guys back when hopefully she's uh, ready to impregnate us. Alrighty, guys, we're getting some pretty big blood splatters here. I'm going to switch over to HP now to uh, to do it on him because he hits a little less harder as... Uh, no, 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 chill out, chill out. Hits a little less harder than uh, Omegalo, so we should be able to do it. Um, it's just a bit hard to sort of gauge. It is bloody. I don't think it's at that. Maybe it is. I don't know. Let's go play mode light. Let's see. No, I don't think it's at that bloody, bloody stage yet. So we'll just keep whacking it. I may have got done it a little bit earlier. I just need to make sure we don't kill it. Let's turn the light off. Check. It's definitely bloody. Just don't know how bloody. Couple more hits. Turn the light off again. Not there yet, but it's definitely pretty close, I would say. Alright, let's go. Two more. Come on, mate. Give me your good stuff. Oh, it's surely it's got to be close. I'll go two now at a time. Turn the light off. All right, we're still waiting, still waiting. Let's go again. We got two bites. Turn the light off again. Oh, it's still not there. Alright, it's got to be close though, like surely, right? Let's go another bite. No, it's still not there. Oh, okay. Alright, I, I don't want to kill it. I'm always so nervous. I still didn't make a bloody magnifying glass at base either, did I? Let's do that and we'll turn it off again. Okay, we're still still going. Do it like that. I don't want to mess this up. Like, you know, it's a 145 Reaper Queen. Really don't want to mess this up. She's still not there, though. Let's turn the light off. Alright, alright, alright. Still not there. God damn. Just let us get pregnant. I don't want to kill her. And I know I keep saying that, but it's bloody nerve-wracking. Because look, like, look how bloody she is. Alright, let's do it again. Oh, shit. Throw our feather light. Come here, little dude. Feather light, where are you going? Don't get eaten by the Reaper, please. There you go. Why can't I not reach you? 
Why is it, like, honestly? There we go. Come here, you stupid little thing. Alright, cool. She got the pink glow? No, she doesn't. So, we're going to go back in for some more biting, I guess. Alright, let's do this. This Reaper is extremely bloody. Holy smokes. Alright, here we go again. I'm so nervous and terrified. Still not there. I don't know what Reaper's health regeneration is like, wild ones. But like, I feel like it's not that high. Still not seeing the pink glow. It's super bloody. Still nothing. Come on. <gasps> there it is. We got it. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Here we go. That's her roar. No, she's not going to impregnate us. We're going to have this little tussle again. This little fight. I'm going to hit her a couple of times. Just so in case. Wait, why did that... Oh, I was going to say, why did that scrap it for? Come on. Attack me. Give me your baby. Give it to me. Oh yeah. I know you like the whip. I know you like being whipped. So give me the baby. Oh. Come on. Give me the whip. Our rock drake's looking a little low. I gotta be careful here. Oh, here she goes. Atta girl. Give it to me. Give me your seed. Oh, yeah, that feels good. Alright, that's what we like to hear. Get on you. Alrighty, guys. Rock, uh, Reaper, Reaper King Baby number two is done and dusted. Uh, I need to make sure that I don't die, actually. So let's just chat down on some fish meat. Keep the light on. Awesome. Alright, cool. Well, I mean, that was successful. Wait, why is our light not on? Light up, light up, light up. Give us some light. Give us some light before the freaking nameless come. Alright, awesome. We're going to cryo up you real quick. Awesome. Cool. Alrighty, well, that's pretty much good to go. I'm going to wrap up the episode here today, guys. We're going to raise this Reaper uh, off camera and it'll be hopefully ready for you guys next episode. But all we need to do is get the water artifact, which we can do next episode. Um... And breed up some more megalos. But yeah, we got the we got the female. We got impregnated again, which is dope. By one freaking 45, which is even more awesome. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe down below for more. But other than that, guys, I will catch you in the next one.